Okay, so, you know, I think one of the things that we can say easily hands down is an artist can only be as successful as they prepare themselves to be. Right. So in order to succeed on a photo shoot, on a film set, with a bride, you have to set yourself up for success and that comes down to stocking the right kit. Now we have a wonderland of things in front of us. Now tell me exactly. Is this a be-all, end-all, can-do-anything kit, or is this a specific event kit? No, this is everything. I can do anything with this. This is my magic bag. So this is something that I can take anywhere. Um, it's nice, and it, I actually have, I've got different kits, and I've had many different kits through the years. For a hair kit like this, a little suitcase, a little carry-on is perfect because I can get everything in. I can take out just a few things, the wet things and the scissors, you know, the sharp things that can't go on a plane with me, you know, with me, and just check those. And then everything else I can keep together in my yeah. kit. It's awesome. Yeah, so this is my magic bag. So, okay, let's <laughs> the, 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 the giddy excitement when you just describe it. I can't wait to see what lives inside it. <laughs> okay, so let's just start putting it together. Um, so this right here. So this is actually just a little mini hair kit of every kind of thing that you can need. So I've got dry shampoo. I have water. I, I even have shampoo. I've got iron guard, uh, hair glue. I have hair glue remover. I have hand sanitizer, and I've got um, beach spray, I have hair fiber, and... These are just a whole lot of examples of things that people could really benefit from having in their small, kit. Small, in small portions. So it's, it's everything that you need, but you need it small so that you can get around with it and, and you can um, not have a problem you know, maneuvering and you can get everything into one bag. And not only so. when you're traveling, but also when you've got to be on set and be grabbing things. You don't want to be grabbing right. giant bottles of everything to do a fix. Uh -huh. Usually I do a separate set bag, but I do have everything in here so I can whip together a quick yeah. set bag you know, with this kit itself. So um, I've got, yeah, these are little containers that I, I just get, you know, just to put in like hair putty, hair paste, you know, hair oil, you know, things like that. So all of that is self-contained in this little bag. And then I have, uh, these are actually just hair colors. So these are yeah. real color palettes. So, so these, are, these are different dark color tones and then, and then I've got all the whites and the grays. And so like I can actually, I, you never know when you're gonna have to do retouch or you've got you know, some d director that hasn't established it before but decides, oh, you know, this actor needs to be older. You know, so you've gotta quickly gray his hair you know, or whatever. You've got it right there. You know, so it's actually really easy to access. So, um, so you want to have that. I have Ziploc bags, and that's just that's so that I can put my. If I don't have time to clean my combs and my brushes before I leave set, I've got those dirty ones in here, and I take it home and I clean them as soon as I get home. Without making your entire bag unsanitary. Right. Yeah. Exactly. So and and you always need Ziploc bags, so that's a, a really nice thing to just have all the time. And then I've got super glue. Like maybe I'm going to make an extent an extension ring. Um, for the hair, I've got extensions and I can take uh, just fishing line and just put a dab of, su of super glue on it on that. Actually, there, there are a lot of times when I run into needs for super glue, so that's just a, a staple for me. So that's actually really important. And I've got, um, this is an accessory kit. So it's just got all kinds of, of different hair accessories. I've got headbands and I've got, you know, just, this is just, some, I've got fabric in here and ribbon and Because you know, if you're on a set and suddenly, suddenly the director says, oh my God, can we have something, can you give her some glamour in the hair? That's right, and yeah. if you're like in the middle of the desert doing a shoot and yeah. you don't have a kit like that, you're suddenly like, what did I wear? Yeah. Because where else would you pull it from? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So, and you, you just never know what you're going to be up against. And even though you, know, you get the call sheet, you get the script ahead of time, things always change, so always. you have to be adaptable. So everything, I even take old necklaces and that are broken or you know whatever and I'll re-rig them so that I can use them in my hair bag. So, and I, this is just one bag for this kit. I actually have trays of <laughs> just accessories. So like when I'm running a, a film and I've got you know all kinds of you know different needs or whatever, I have all of my trays that I take and just leave them in the trailer so everybody can use those, so. Yeah. yeah.